my name is Dean Sewell. I'm an a environmental and social documentary photographer. I've done much stuff in Australia and overseas around environmental concerns. What do you think of planetary health, what it means and, and how people would relate to it? Um, like, like you say, it is a, a relatively fresh sort of term, like um, it, it is even for me. It's just the state of our our you know, collective ecosystems, how they um, how they how they function, um, and uh, you know ensuring that um, we keep those ecosystems in, in in good health for not only for our for our, our own sake, but for those of you know future generations. When I began um, looking environmental issues seriously, I'd say you know twenty or twenty plus years ago, all we heard of at when climate warming began was that our polar ice caps were melting. For those reasons, that was important to change that terminology around and so people could um, could understand that it wasn't just a, a, a simple warming effect that was going on uh, across the planet, but you know, much, much greater. And, and so now we're seeing new terms, you know, I guess, being introduced. So getting back to, I, I guess, I, I guess why um, an exhibition of such is, is important is it's going to give, I guess, people, and particularly up here, a, a moment of pause and reflection to uh, consider those events and, and others, of course, which we, will which be we brought into the, the, the exhibition. But which works did you include in this exhibition? Um, I've, I've got two series. Um, yeah. One is on the current on the, the, the current fire, the last fire season, the Black Summer fires. Yep. And the other, the other one is a is a more conceptual based body of work um, around um, coal seam gas. It's called Propaganda Lo Locals around Canamble um, that were that were opposed to the um, to the gas field and just normal people. So I've got a series of uh, of portraits of uh, people like um, you know wearing these like pretty <laughs> pretty haunting looking um, there is Israeli military issue gas masks. I have these people in situ on their farms, on their land with um, wearing these masks. So part of that series will be in the, will, will be um, 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 in the, the exhibition as well. Years ago, we used to, we would say that we rode off the back of the sheep in this yeah. country. Now it's, now it's coal and, 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 and coal seam gas. And for the people that attend the exhibition and view your works, what are you hoping they take away from it? My work is, uh, is produced for mass consumption. That's what I, you know. So I, I drive my work through newspapers and and through mainstream media. I think I, 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 you know, it's proof. It shows what what is occurring, um, and and I like how it can make the transition from a newspaper to an art gallery wall in a frame. You know, we can see even now you have commissions or Senate hearings going on about the, about the bushfire crisis, but those debates that occur can turn a lot of people off. Photography is is one of those good mediums, I think, for contributing to such debates. What's your vision for what the next, you know, the next hundred years would become known as Australia's great success? A future that is built around you know, green energy, like um, uh, renewable energy. It's just, uh, you know, it just, it, it makes a lot of sense to me. Um, and I think to a, to a lot of people, um, why aren't we, why aren't we harvesting this energy in, in, a, in, a, in a smart way. We have it all here. Back to the, the, the themes of planetary health, where, where do you think this you know, emerging conversation and particularly the critical mass exhibition fits into that picture? The importance of art um, in, in helping you know, people to interpret complicated um, or, or complex issues, um, art can draw them back into the conversation and you need you need to pull everybody in um, and sometimes it's just good to give people a bit of breathing space and let them let them digest this stuff give them a moment of pause and, and reflection about um, uh, about these events and, and how they're and how they're changing <laughs>